Hello everyone, it's Bloody Young here, and welcome back to the Cricket Van. In the last, in the last episode, we found our house was haunted, and found we eventually stumbled upon an at, an address. So then we eventually decided to come here to investigate. Right now we are looking for someone. Okay. First, we found this doorknob so then we have to use it on this door over here so make sure I'm ready okay put the doorknob on get on my novels right with tourist and info maps there is a trap door over there I'll to check in a moment <coughs> the book of the month the strange case of Dr. Jekyll uh, Jekyll and Mr. Heed. Gotcha. Trash can's empty. <coughs> and a phone. Small door, which one open? Doesn't even seem to have a lock. Okay. So we go back. Wait, you don't have anything to open it? Hmm. Not gonna say anything about that trap door. No, you don't seem to say anything about that. Okay, so then, oh, I said to myself I would quit constantly saving, but eh. Okay, here we go. Okay, so where do we go now? Hello. Still can't get into that room. Oh, right, I forgot I can go into this room. Let's go ahead and find Sissy. Let's see, maybe she's upstairs. If we can't find anything new, then we'll see about Bill will let us leave the area for today. Not in here. She's in here? Alright, no, she's not in there. Maybe she's in the dining room. Hey, sissy, where are you? No, nope. wait, no, there's another corner over here. It's still locked. Still quite a few locked doors over here. Okay, let's check the downstairs. Any keys on me? I've, I've still have that brass key. I don't know what it's going to be used for. Okay, I guess we. I guess we leave for the day. If it'll let us, let's see, do we need stone to look around? Nope, I still gotta look around. So I guess we gotta do something in that room. Hmm, this tile seems a little loose. Not yet. We gotta make sure we've discovered everything. Nothing in here. <coughs> so we don't get the code yet. So I guess the only thing we, even though I didn't look that much, I guess the only thing that we can do is stomp on that tile. Then let's go ahead and save it by the tile so then if something happens, we can revert back to that save. Okay, here we go. Stomp. Oh, did that open that lock over here? Hello. 
It opened. Was there a me mechanism in the floor? There's a ladder, and it goes down. Where else? Maybe I should check this out. As Marcus say, nope, nope, nope. But here we go. Can't see a thing. I need a light. Boo. Oh. Hello. Oh, explosive barrels, gasoline. That's totally such a good sign. Clamp oil. Equipment. A drum. Smells like gasoline. <coughs> you probably should be careful around that too. Gasoline is good. Okay, here we go. There's someone there. Hey, do you have free candy? Oi. I figure Crouch is on the floor. Uh, are you okay? Were you locked in here? You should run. Uh, what? Uh, are you okay? Whoa! Stay back! Don't come near me! You shouldn't have come down. What? Crap! Let go! Let go! Get off of me! No one said you could grab me. <coughs> hey, probably should close that trap door all the way. His neck was all crooked. Kind of been human. Am I just going nuts here? That thing. It couldn't have been real. I must just be seeing things. I'm just so tired, is all. Urk, I feel sick. I wonder, if si I wonder what Sissy's up to. Did she find what she came for? Probably should have locked that door more. Alright. Wait, can we go back down there? I'd rather not. Okay. Okay, here we go. We played such a good horror game in a while, so might be a little bit jumpy. <laughs> okay, so if I were Sissy, I'd probably be in one of the rooms. So let's check the left wing. No, piano room. That's where we found her last time. No, she's not here. Perhaps she went to the library? Ooh, wait. Oh, that's probably coming from one of the rooms here. Uh, this one? No, this one. The floor collapsed. Sissy, what, what happened? I went to, I, I, <coughs> I, I went to the window and the floor gave way. What, what should I do? Sissy, jump over. It's dangerous over there. Uh, no, no I can't. I'm slipping. And I can't possibly jump that far. A big, a gap that big. This is no time for pessimism. It's going to crumble quick. Hurry, I'll catch you. Ack. Okay, caught you. Uh, that was close. Are you okay, sissy? Are you hurt, sissy? So scared. 
I'm so scared. No more. I... I don't like the dark. Why... Why do I... I... It's okay, sissy. I'm sorry. I know you were scared, but it's fine now. Don't cry. I... I'm sorry. I was scared and confused. It's alright. I'm glad you're not hurt. Did you find what you were looking for? <coughs> <coughs> I'm slowly getting over my sickness here. But, sorry about all the coughing. No. Not yet. It wasn't in, in the room we stayed in. I wonder where could it be? It must be important if you're looking all alone. You can always just give up on it. It's not entirely safe here. I, I can't give up on it. I have to find it. What exactly is it? Sorry to ask, but I've just been wondering. Was it a present or... It's a present for my boyfriend. It's the most important thing to me. After my own life. Ah, I see. Sorry if I was rude. I'll keep looking for it too. You're looking for someone, right? <clears throat> oh wait. You're, lo you're looking for someone, right? I haven't met anyone yet, but can you tell me more about them? Er... Well, I don't know much either. Just he's a man about my age. Huh? You know that little about the person you're looking for? Hehe. <laughs> you're, you're a strange guy, David. I, I'm not. There's just some things I want to ask. And I don't know how he looks because, um... Strange. But very kind. You're not gonna ask her about the the creature that was just in that basement? I would have been hurt badly if you weren't here. I'm really grateful for really grateful to you for saving me. I should get going. Take care, David. I'll see you. Okay, save. And here we go. Oh, crooked man. Now maybe I can leave. Oh, come on. So then, uh, let's, I guess we gotta go back into that room. The basement door's open. Well, that's because you stupidly left it open when I tried to help you close it. So now I guess who's loose? <coughs> yep, he's gone. Big barrels. Seems like they're wine casts. Lamp, the severed coil. Oh, there's something over here. Bronze key. Maybe it goes to the bar? Okay, better be careful. He could be anywhere. looked at that. Okay, I'll put my save here. So then if I die, I pop up right there. Okay, I'll take a guess the bar. Actually, let's try the other doors. 
My best bet is the bar right there. Okay, that one's already unlocked. Open. Open. Gotta make sure I don't accidentally open the door. Oh, don't want to accidentally walk into the room. That's already open. Open. And that's already open. Okay, so then let's try upstairs. Oh wait. Yeah. Okay. Paint over. Paint over. Nope, that's already open. Over, paint over. Okay, so then we have to go over there. I sense a trap in here. Two beer bottles. around first before I do anything. Glass. I'm guessing we have to read that book, but let's look around real quickly if we can. Hmm? Brandy. It's just, it's just got tons of alcohol in it. Might just catch on fire if I drink this. Okay, so I need to keep an eye for that. Empty beer bottles. <coughs> okay. Get ready to read the book. A journal. A journal seem, seemingly written by a staff member. The last page is rambling and sloppy writing. A toast to our owner who left his employees and fled into the night. We'll drink all the beer we've got. Hell, it's just the only thing, only good thing here. Being out of job. Being out of a job's no good, but at least we don't have to see his mug no more. We were so sick of the of that egghead always trying to flaunt his intelligence and sawing weird stuff for the basement door, having a number lock on the food storage, all his silly crap made to a place impossible to run. Plus the passcode was this thing with a book which he changed up every month. What the hell do you do if you forget? Maybe it's no good for him. But sure as hell, not us. Ah, whatever. Once we're done with the booze, we're out of here. A toast to our bright futures. The door to the food storage is at the far end of the first door, right? Pa a password on food is pretty crazy. You're gonna jump me, aren't you? You're not? I was expecting something. Okay, to the library then. <coughs> Maybe it's over here somewhere. Is the <coughs> I type to R. Excuse me, I'm drink some water. Order. Oh, there you are. I'll put you on my right side.
Like tight and Okay, so not on this side. This oh, wait. The blackboard in the owner's room said, strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Heed. He'd be on this shelf, right? Ah, here we go. Mr. Utterson, the Mr. Utterson, the lawyer was a good man of rugged countenance that was covered, that was never light, lighted by a smile, cold, scanty, and embarrassed in discourse, backward in sentiment, lean, long, dusty, de dreary, and yet somehow lovable. At friendly meetings, and when the wine was to his taste, something emin eminently human beckoned from his eyes, something indeed which never found its way back into his talk, which spoke not only in these silent symbols of the after-dinner face, but more often and loudly in the acts of his life. Wait, I read that right? Yeah. He was aster astery, I think, with himself, drank again when he was alone to mortify a taste of taste for vintages, and though he enjoyed the theater, had not crossed the doors of of one for twenty for twenty years. Sorry, I'm a little tired. Yep, that's my excuse. We had approved torrent for others for others sometimes, wondering, almost with envy, at the high pressure of spirit involved in their misdeeds and in any. Oh God, I'm not gonna read all of this. I'll I'll leave this open for a little bit. You're welcome to pause the video to read it. And then we'll move on. I bet this is just going to be a bunch of reading. No, I don't want to read it again. Okay, so after all that reading, I should probably make sure to save. You would think it'd be packed somewhere. Codes in one of the book in, in the book over there, and I just skim right through it. Ah. Oh hi! Where are you? Oh, hi there. Okay, do we go back to the library and escape there? go up. It's coming this way. Crap. I gotta escape. <coughs> <coughs> okay. I hope we gotta go up. Oh crap. You're getting faster. Crap. K. 
game over. Okay, let's try that again. Maybe there's something in that room we gotta use. Crooked man. Come on. Come on, we can have the staring contest all day. Bring it. too late so crap you're on to me right there If I drop him here, if I drop him down here, come here, crooked man. Sayonara. <laughs> bye bye. <sighs> what is that monster? What? Oh. So, so what I saw earlier. I can't believe such a thing exists. But there's no no way it's coming back now. The room under is locked tight. I should warn sh Sissy when I see her. I knew it would be dangerous for her. Okay, got that bugger out of the way. I thought I'd throw something at him. Like I wouldn't mind throwing that cat candle at him. Hmm, I'm guessing that she's going to be in trouble. He's in this room. No, wait, this room. No, it's the room to my right, right there. Okay, so I need to go find Sissy. Oi, Sissy! Eh. And we will find her in the next video. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked this video, feel free to give it a like. Subscribe for more further content. It helps quite a bit. And I hope you all have a good day slash night. See ya, everyone.